often get asked about is if you're growing up in a small town or if you're geographically challenged, you know, they come to me and they're like, well, you're in LA and it's easier to get your word out, but you did it. And was that, uh, how did you use Missouri to your advantage and your benefit? Yeah, it was definitely an advantage. I think um, I see no disadvantage in it at all. And especially now because of the internet, the playing field has been leveled. I don't think it was, I don't think it is now what it once was. Um, the major benefit for me was, um, well, there's a couple of them. I think cost-wise, I opened my shop in Kansas City 10 years ago, and I had to have a full-time job the first seven years of that, of that store um, and wanted to. I was excited to do that, but I w there's no way I would have been able to open a store in New York or LA on my own dime. And I think combined, uh, my store rent and my apartment rent was like still under 700 bucks. So it was like, uh -huh. it was kind of stupid not to. <laughs> like you had to, yeah. you know? So, and, and so it was kind of like a fun, expensive hobby at the beginning. Yeah. It was like a project that I felt comfortable pursuing and um, felt that the opportunity was there. So I had to take advantage of it. There's no way I could have done that somewhere else. I mean, I didn't have money otherwise. I had to work, I had to work a full-time job in order to do it. Also, we were bored, so we made stuff. There wasn't um, a party photographer. There wasn't like a, a, a see and be seen event every night that you just can't miss. We were bored in Kansas City making stuff for each other to impress one another. And um, that's a work ethic that developed that I still rely on today and kind of always kind of questioning my intentions and my integrity and in what and why I'm doing something.